Hey, magnificent mathematicians, let's go through test question five, four <laughs> to figure out why we missed this. A utility line runs underground through Shane's rectangular backyard. Shane is not allowed to dig within three feet of the utility line. The diagram below shows the dimensions of Shane's backyard in feet. The dashed line represents a utility line. What is the area in square feet of the part of the backyard in which Shane is allowed to dig? So he is allowed to, let's see, I'm going to highlight it, even though I know you guys didn't really have highlighters on the test, but you can always ask for them. Um, those are the parts he's allowed to dig in. I have some choices here. I can find the area of the entire thing and then subtract the no digging part. Or I can find the area of the first rectangle and the area of the second rectangle that I highlighted. So I am missing this little piece on the other side of my two, three feet. Um, but I know the entire thing is 22 and six plus 14 equals 20. Therefore, this little guy is two feet. So that's what I choose to do. I choose to find the area of both rectangles. So the first one is A equals 17 times 14. And the second one is A equals 17 times 2. Well, I have no idea what 17 times 14 is off the top of my head, so I'm going to have to work that out. 17 times 14. 7 times 4 is 28. Carry the 2. 6, 0 placeholder. All right, looks like this guy is 238. And then I do know what 17 times 2 is off the top of my head. It's 34. So then this guy is 34. Now I would add those two together. And it looks like I got answer choice F. Uh, if I wanted to check my work, I would multiply 22 times 17 to find the area of the entire thing. And then find the area of the no digging part, which is 17 by 6. 7 times 6 is 42. And then subtract those two which I still get 272. So either way, F is my answer. Woohoo!